Sierra Circuit's bandwidth, rise time, and critical length calculator helps you to compute various parameters to analyze high-speed traces and avoid signal distortion. Most importantly, it calculates the critical length of the trace. If the trace is longer than its critical length, it should be treated as a controlled impedance line. Otherwise, the trace can be analyzed based on standard network theory. Choose the required transmission line geometry, uncoded and coded microstrips. The input parameters are dielectric constant and anyone among maximum data transfer rate, fastest signal rise time, maximum frequency content, and 3 dB bandwidth. Let's enter the dielectric constant as 2.5. You can choose a second input parameter by selecting the checkbox right next to the field that you wish to enter. For now, let's choose the fastest signal rise time. Enter 2 nanoseconds and hit calculate. Please note that you can change the units using the respective dropdowns. The tool now displays the values of the other three parameters along with the effect of dielectric constant, propagation delay per unit length, propagation speed, rise time length, wavelength, critical length, and maximum short length. If you would like to change your second input parameter, you can simply select the respective checkbox and enter the value. For instance, let's select maximum frequency content and enter 4 GHz. Click on Calculate to view the updated results. Analysis of trace parameters such as bandwidth, rise time, and critical length is one of the key steps when it comes to high-speed designs. If you would like to know more about these parameters, click on the respective Help button. Our Bandwidth Rise Time Critical Length Calculator will assist you in computing these important characteristics with ease. Thank you.